What is going on everybody? Today I'm going to be giving you a tutorial on how to change your custom thumbnail on your Apple device. Now, if this if you are a YouTube partner or you've set up your video on for up for monetization or you have the feature that YouTube gave recently gave us so you can have custom thumbnails and this video is for you. Um, this will not be a video on how to get custom thumbnails without being a partner. But it's really simple to just put up one video for monetization. Just make sure there's no copyrights infri infringement. So, yeah. So, of course, when you go to YouTube on your iPad, this will show up. But to have get your custom thumbnails, you need the desktop version. Uh, don't worry, this is available on the iPad only. On the iPad only. And, yeah. I don't know if this is for the... Um, the iPhone or iPod, but yeah, for j I'm just testing it on the iPad. So go down, scroll down here, and go to desktop right there. Under now, once you hit desktop, now you will go into the actual desktop YouTube version. So since you're in here, um, now you can get your custom thumbnails. So of course, go into your video manager. And let's say there's a video that you want to have add a custom thumb to thumbnail to. This one right here. What? This one? So, of course, there's the custom thumbnail button there. Now, you have to already make a custom thumbnail, and it has to be on the iPad. So, the app I really recommend to you is Graffiti Designer Plus. So, let me just show it to you right there. And it's a really cool graffiti app. I'm not going to go into depth with it. I'm just going to show you a thumbnail that I made with Graffiti Designer Plus right there. I made this with Graffiti Designer Plus. So I'm going to go ahead and this is already saved my photos. Once you're in your custom, your video editor, not the video editor, but that the basic info and settings for your video go under here to custom thumbnail and go to choose existing or if you want to take a photo or something like let's say it's a video of your cat and you don't want to take a better photo of your cat you just go back to take photo video photo or video but i'm going to go choose existing camera roll and here's my thumbnail that i made And boom, it will show up. Now all I have to, all I have to do is, it's already selected. All I got to do is go to save changes. It's saving, 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 and saved. Now this probably might take a day at least to th change the thumbnail. I don't know because that's how long it took for me to get my other two thumbnails on. But I'm just going to go and to my video man. And then just show you that it works. Video manager. Doesn't seem to want to go there. There. Okay, once I go onto my uploads. Ah, my goodness. <clears throat> well, see, as you can see, it's not processing it, but these two other ones are custom thumbnails that I made. I'll go into video manager. I'm pretty sure it will show up there. Yeah, see? Right there. My video that I edited now has a custom thumbnail. So, yeah, this is the same with... This is a little different with the PC. I'll be doing a different tutorial on on that. But, for now, thanks. I'm just going to do it on the iPad tutorial. So, thank you all for watching, guys. And... I'll be doing a, probably, I don't know if I'll be doing a review on Graffiti Designer, but yeah, I probably will be. So, thanks for watching, guys, and that's how you get custom thumbnails. You're, you're already enabled for that on the iPad. Thanks for watching.